Welcome. This is Jed Schlackman. I'm going to give a little short presentation here regarding the Tibetan Himalayan singing bowls. These bowls have been used for hundreds of years at least in meditation and healing practices in the Himalayas region in Asia. And you'll notice that there's a few different types of bowls that are in use. Some of them are made the traditional way. They are molded by hand and those balls are not perfectly smooth. As a result of that, the balls create a wider spectrum of frequencies. There are also some more modern balls that are made in a very nice, perfectly smooth manner, which creates a more pure tone but that tone is not as diverse as far as having a wider range of frequencies and overtones. So it's usually not considered to be the same healing grade of bowls as the ones that are made the traditional way. So we're going to hear a few examples of the Tibetan or Himalayan singing bowls. First we have here a little small bowl This bowl is actually made in India, and as you noticed, I'm playing the bowl with a wooden mallet or striker. It's called a puja, and it creates a rather high pitched tone. Next, we're going to hear a bowl that creates a lower tone. This is one of the more modern bowls. And this one is very artistic in its design. It may be hard to see in the imagery here, but there's a very ornate design on the rim or edge of the bowl. And there's also a Buddha design inside the bowl. So this bowl is made with a very smooth finish. This bowl I'm playing with a mallet or striker that has suede on it. And so the suede surface played around the rim of the bowl creates a smoother type of tone. And the smoothness of this bowl also makes it sound a little bit more like a crystal singing bowl would sound. very nice smooth meditative type of sound from this bowl and this is the way the mallet appears so it's got the wooden handle with the suede surface to play along the edge or rim of the bowl the next bowl we're going to hear is a traditionally designed bowl This is a very large bowl, which creates a very deep tone. And I also am going to play this bowl with a wooden striker.
I noticed with that ball, the sound really started to increase or expand as I went around the rim. So it's like a wave of sound that builds up and builds up and becomes more strong and intense. These bowls can be used for meditations. They can be used for vibrational healing since the sound waves and vibrations resonate through our body, through our energy field. And it's something that each person experiences in their own unique way. I enjoy playing a variety of these bowls because each one has its own character or personality to it. Each bowl has its unique spectrum of frequencies or tones that are generated. And there's both the healing and meditative element as well as the musical element to these bowls. And it's something that I encourage each of you to explore, to learn more about, to experience on your own.